Okay, guys, what we wound up doing, because we, we added the, uh, this was the first time we added the, uh, the, what do you call them, um, the herbal syrup. Um, we added, wound up adding an extra three quarters of a cup to that. And it, this is what we got now. We got like a th very thick, loose type of dough. And here's what we're going to do we're on a real floured um, surface. We're going to start to make our logs. And we're going to make them about um, half inch to um, and about six inches long. And don't worry about the flour that gets on the, on these logs because after they dry, after a couple of hours or even overnight, you just get like a pastry brush and just dust that off. And um, what you're going to do is you just let this sit for about an hour till it gets hard. Then you can transfer it over to um, a like a, a cookie tray, a floured cookie tray, and just let them uh, go overnight or just like it says an extra couple hours. And um, and then you'll have your your liquishes the way the size you cut them the size you want. I recommend. I mean, I've been doing them for like about uh, every six inches, and you get a good uh, liquish. And you just just gotta keep the the initial stages dry, and because it is like a, a loose dough at the beginning. But once once after a few hours, it starts to harden up and gets its uh, liquish texture. You'll see what what we're talking about. But um, once, like I said, once you they are movable, you just put them on the the dry the the cookie tin, the cookie trays, and just let them dry for a bit. And uh, you'll with this this little batch that we made, you you should have a, a good yield, and uh, you get over a pound. I know that. And the nice thing about this is now you got another bar object, and else and like I said, we're gonna pause again after. And um, I'm going to show you real quick. I'm going to grab this thing. And I'm going to show you, you know, what, I st what I'm starting to do here to make the, to get these uh, liquid logs going. And I'm just going to um, just get this last one right here. Let me see, bring this closer. These are what, this is what they look like. I don't know how well you can see. batch do another uh, just keep them dusted really well at the beginning because they're like a sticky dough And then once these dry, just transfer them on the, onto your uh, your cookie tin. And now, as these are drying, this is cooling down even more. So this is you're gonna get a little bit thicker consistency, a little a thicker texture than this. Because right now you can see uh, this is like a, a very like loose uh, dough. And uh, but these are gonna these taste awesome. And uh, I'll tell you, we're gonna go like I said, we're gonna pause right now again. Well, just if you got any quick guys, if you got any questions, just post them in the comments. I promise you, I'll get back to you because I love for you guys to try this and learn it. If you got any problems, you've run into any problems, just text me, email me, or call me on the the app from the app, which is free. You can download from our site herbalsurvival.net. Also, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And uh, if you got any suggestions too. Also, put them in the comments. I love to hear criticism and uh, comments. And don't be ever be afraid to, to criticize on what we're doing here. If you got better ideas, just put them up there. And because it's all about learning and having fun and saving money, guys, in a realistic fashion. I mean, there's a lot of a lot of things going said that this can be done, that can be done. But how effective are they, and how realistic are they, how cost efficiently 
effective are they? Are they? So we've I've already used this, tried this, and it actually works. And uh, this recipe is the first with the elderberry, but the syrup I've used for the last two years with great success. And so um, that's about it, guys, uh, for for this one. And uh, so um, this is the first video of Liquish, and we're gonna do another one with a different. We're gonna try uh, another combination of herbs, and for a different purpose. But like I said, we're going to pause again, then I'm going to just sit down with you guys and explain this.